I'm Dr. Sarah Ferrand-Sorbet, uh, Rothschild Foundation Hospital in Paris. I'm no surgeon. The research we do uh, about the hypothalamic hematoma is to study a special technique, the uh, stereotactic transventricular endoscopic technique. And uh, we did a retrospective study um, between 1998 until 2017 for all the patients who have been treated with this technique. And we had a look uh, at all the uh, demographic um, items and the follow-up in terms of seizure outcome and in terms of comorbidity, associated comorbidities. Um, the statistic analysis highlights two important points. The first time, which is quite easy to understand but it's uh, significant, here in this study is that the time between serial onset and surgery is a predictive factor for a good outcome in terms of serial control. And the second point um, is that a normal development at the time of surgery is also a predictive factor uh, for good outcome in terms of uh, seizure control. An international um, symposium is important because it is the best way to share our experience and the advantages and the disadvantages of different techniques and also, I mean, in terms of neurosurgery, but also with all the people, all the different specialties who are involved in the treatment of hypothalamic hematoma. Um, I mean, neurologic, but also psychiatric, neuropsychologic, endocrinologic, and uh, the, 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 the aim is to find the best way to treat these patients in the globality and not only in terms of seizures. 